Hey guys, welcome. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing on the Race Tech 52mm boost gauge. So we have on the top stepper motor opening ceremony. On the sides we have all the different gauges that Race Tech do. And also on the other side. So this one we have peak warning gauges and on this side we have default warnings. So this one that we have here is a peak one and it is blue. On the back side we have instructions on the oil pressure and oil temp gauges and instructions on the water temp gauges all right let's open it up i've got quite a few of these if you haven't seen them check out some of my other videos i really like the opening ceremony on them um, except for the noise but you can turn the noise off you can see it's smoked it's got this little protective film on it that's a 52 it's in there nice and tight it's actual unit not very deep we've got all the plugins at the back so here it shows boost gauge it's at 270 degrees and it's psi says that it's a step motor movement the blue peak quality control made in Taiwan and it's for 12 volt negative grounded vehicles only give you a closer view not very deep get the right angle you can see it when it's not plugged in go if you want to have a look um, right now you can check out some of my other videos this is my second boost one as I am running a compound turbo so we'll look what else is in the box sorry about that guys what's in here So we have the cup, these are the scissors, there we go, all the mounting hardware, got the cup, got some tape, have a bolt, the bolt goes through that part, which is a closed on the base. So this is the base. You can bend it to all different angles. And we have the cup that goes on there like so. And it's cut out here where all the wires come out. Put some 3M tape with it. and some soft tape to go around the cup to hold it in place and this one here slides over like so and that is for I guess for some shade so you can see it a bit better have some vacuum line We have this sender. Right. This one here is the sender. Electronic sender. Oops. So this part plugs into the back of the gauge. 
that plugs into this unit right here you mount that my one is mounted under the dash and I'll mount this one under the, under the dash as well then we need boost so that packing line goes onto there that goes to your filter inline filter and into a T so into the turbo so just chopping backing lines between the compressor housing and the wastegate tap into that this is the power so if it's your only gauge use this one as I'm mounting it next to another gauge I can just do daisy chain so it just plugs into the other gauge and we jump it off that and power our gauge with that one so we have that one in for the power and this one in for the boost we also have instructions so just down the bottom here shows you boost and backing gauges where to wire them up what all the wiring does and whereabouts to and how to install it like I said before we have this unit, so this one here, into a boost line, into the filter, into the line again, and then into the T-piece. Let's install it, and I'll show you how it works. Opening ceremony. Closing. Just click on the link above to see an install video for this Race Tech Boost Gauge. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and leave a like. I can only see the GT35 gauge. Love it. If I went up to nine. I can't see the other gauge at all. Oh, a little bit through the growth, bro.